Tiger Prism can allow you to label any PSDN digits. For example, here in this report, it has a label of Tiger-Steeple-Sales. To do this, you simply need to go to the Cool Terrace tile, to Destination Sets, and click on the Search button. In here, you'll have a list of destination sets if you've already created them. If not, to create new destination sets, click Create in the top right hand corner. Give the destination set a name and a description. Once you've done this, you will then need to click on the Destinations tab at the top. To add new destinations in this list, simply then click the plus button. Type in the digits you want to match. Please note this is a wildcard match. So if you type in plus 44142, it will match anything that starts with those digits. Then give it a label. Once you've given it a label, simply click the tick button. You also have the ability to import a whole list of numbers. To do this, first click on the export to CSV button. Then simply open the CSV file. You must make sure the header is in the CSV file. So it must be digits, comma, label. Then insert the phone numbers on the first column and the description in the second column. The descriptions can be no longer than 50 characters and should not contain commas. Then once you have a list, you can then import this into the system. To do this, simply go back to your screen Click on the import button. You will then get a prompt to say this is going to override all existing destination sets. So if you're going to merge two together, please make sure that you do merge before you import again. Click on confirm, browse to where the file is, and it will then simply import the destination sets. Once they're created and imported, you now need to assign the destination sets to the tariffs. To do this, Go to the tariff section under the cool tariffs and search. Select the tariff you wish to assign the destination set to. Click on the edit button and choose the destination set from the drop down list. Once you've done that, click save. From that moment on, any calls made to those numbers that you've added in will then get a label. For example, in analytics, when you run a report, it will then label the calls accordingly. These labels will appear in any reports or dashboards or in analytics. Thank you for watching. We hope you have enjoyed this tutorial and if there is anything else you would like to learn about Tiger Prism and its other modules, please visit www.tigercoms.com for more tutorials and information.